This is Today in Nashville, a celebration of the people, places, and things that make Music City a great place to live. Now your hosts, Kelly Sutton and Carol Sullivan. Days and I'm already ready for some punch. Woo, let's do it. <laughs> I would like to have, a, if there was a big sparkling punch bowl here, it's coming. Ivy, Ivy's I'm here. I'm so excited. Ivy Odom is here with Southern Living. She has a punch recipe of my dreams. It's so I'm good. Excited. Pomegranate. Like? You know what? We were out last night. We got out and it was so much fun. It was wild. It was awesome. Okay. We watched Reese. It was her opening night at Aladdin, his winter wish. Uh, this was such a fun show to see at TPAC. It really is. I it's didn't great. realize how interactive it is with yep. the audience. Not in terms of you're getting up on stage or doing anything like that, but just mm -hmm. talking back and forth. It's, and it was great for kids. It is so great. Okay, so Panto, if you're not familiar with what Panto is, it is basically when the villain comes out, you boo him, and when the hero comes on stage, you cheer for him and all the wonderful things. But it really is a great introduction for kids that haven't been to theater, if they haven't been to live theater before. Well, also, if yeah. you've ever wanted to take your kids, which I've definitely fallen in this category, but you're a little nervous that they might get antsy or right, talk right, a little right, right. bit. Yeah, this is definitely the one. So Reese was amazing. Thanks. The, all the kids so fun. who were like the dancers for Aladdin, they were just fantastic. So it's Aladdin is Winter it's Wish. It's so great. It's so great. And Kira Kosarin is the star. <laughs> uh, she plays princess. And your son, My Patrick, was like, oh. <gasps> So it brought me some Patrick, and I thought, oh, I'm going to be curious, you know, how this goes. You never know with kids. Like, things yeah, are yeah, so yeah. hot and cold. Yeah, you never know. As soon as it started, he loved it. And then she comes out, and he goes, oh, I grew up watching her on Nickelodeon. Mind you, he's 13. He's 13. Grew up he watching grew her. up watching her. On the Thundermans. On the Thundermans on Nickelodeon. Oh, he was trying to sneak. They say no pictures, but he was trying to sneak a picture so he could show his friends. <laughs> He was watching oh, so uh, the girl from the Thundermans, and yeah. she, you know, as the kids referred to it, but she was incredible. Anyway, it was so, so fun. Yes. Tea pack until December 22nd. If you're thinking of something to do with kids or just the whole family, it's a great one. Listen, we love deals. We love got deals one for you. Use the code MAGIC mm -hmm. and you get $25 tickets. How On fun. Evening performances, anyone that you want, 25 bucks, use the code MAGIC. So good. Good. It really is fun. I mean, I know I'm super biased, but it really was. <laughs> so okay, okay, everybody, we have six more live shows left in 2019, including today. We've been having our very own like countdown, 12 yeah. <laughs> days of Christmas. I mean, we might be eager Maybe. for a little Christmas break. But it's fine. But we get to have a decorative door, and every once in a while, you know, like every day. Oh, somebody we have comes a and brings us presents. It's kind of great. Let's see. Who is it? <gasps> ah! Perfect for Code Blue. Yes. He back is blue. here. What Listen, did you bring have us? Have you guys heard the shout out? Yeah. You do are it. to arrive at should Nissan Stadium on Sunday. Yes, you I should. I mean, yeah, because I'm only on TV. It's Why fine. not? I like Wear it. Wear your powder blue because this is Love the it. uniform that the team is wearing. We have not seen the powder blue yet. This is the first so time. So this is the first time the powder blues are coming out. Do you see the pants? Look at this. Look Whoa, at the team. Wow. You look just slim. Yeah, have it you been you. slimming down? You've lost some weight. Well, you look really good. He's running you around really good. Field. Yeah, yeah. Listen, I'm not going to lie, T-Rack. I'm a little nervous that they're trying something new on such a pivotal game because no, we are going no. against the Texans. It's going to start a new trend. It's going to just catapult the, us right to the Super Bowl. Oh gosh, That's how I feel. From your lips. That's how God's I feel, ears. right? Yes, this is all happening. Kickoff, noon, Nissan Stadium, code blue, y'all. Get, Get there your early. Blue. It's going to be fun. I know, it is going to be great. I ah, love it. The excitement is incredible. Go Titans. Listen, if you haven't heard, we are amazing. We're like the hottest team in the NFL right now, mm, especially yeah. when you look at the stats. It's like, holy cow, what's happening? Yes. I know what's happening. It's December football, t rat Yeah, it Boom. is. We love it. Well, we've got the best <laughs> mascot. I mean, that's why Truly. we're one of the hottest teams. I'm not trying to say. You're, you're so doing it. He's doing it, and he looks fantastic. Did you hear who sings the national anthem? I know. It's Tanya Tucker. 
What? Tanya Tucker coming in. I love this. Country music star kicking off the game at Nissan Stadium. It's Titans versus Texas, and Tucker's in the middle of it. She's gonna. She just released her first album in 17 years. She got four Grammy nominations this year. She's Carol. like, you know, I think I'm gonna put an album out. Oh, and get four Grammys. I think nominated. I'm just gonna, I love like, it. Rule what's happening right now. Song of so. the year too. Yes. Very cool. That's awesome. All right, awesome. T Rack. Listen, thank you for bringing it. I know we you got a you. busy next few days ahead. Woo! Let's do it. Tighten up. Powder blue. We're doing it. Code blue, everybody. Thank Big you, T Rack. Big one. What a fun little surprise. I know. T Rack he's so here. Best. He is. He's one of cute our, little pants. One of our friends. He does look good in his pants. <laughs> look at these. These are really attractive, by the way. Thank you. First thing I saw this morning. Yeah. It's Taylor Swift's birthday. Oh, it is. Happy birthday, like, T Swift. I was like, I love it. Thirty. What a milestone. Aww. Happy birthday, Tay. You can send her some love on Twitter. She is at Taylor Swift 13. She had a great start to her birthday last night when she was awarded Woman of the Decade by Billboard. What a way to wrap up 29, I mean, right? There you go. Just seconds before she turns 30, she gets Decade of the Year. Her acceptance speech was a big call out for women and against the music industry, the way they treat women. She also highlighted that ongoing struggle between Scooter Braun and the back catalog music of her former record label. She's never been one to back down from a fight, and after a lot of success, she just keeps going. So, all right, Tay, hey, enjoy your birthday. Happy 30. It's also my nephew Cody's birthday. Oh, so, happy birthday, Cody. Happy birthday, Cody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. go out and party. It is Friday the 13th. <laughs> go out and party. Did you just realize that it's Friday the 13th? Wow. Why you gotta ruin my Friday? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I shouldn't I have not. even brought that up. That's, I did not. That I'm gonna go bad. hug my black cat and scare everybody. Okay, you know who's, you know who's got a cat? Who? Big Joe on the go. He got a cat? I've been seeing his cat on Twitter and I'm kind of loving it. Is Joe, this new? First of all, I know we've got things to talk about. Yeah. But you know I want to know about your cat. cat Is this update. new? Did you just get a cat? No, I've had the cat for a while. His name's okay. PJ. He loves he loves to watch Lauren Lowry on TV every afternoon. That's not a joke. Oh. He sits in front of the TV and watches every afternoon. So I took a picture and sent it to her, and it was all kind of fun. So we had a good time. Oh, but anyway, awesome. well, yeah. good morning, oh, ladies. Oh, How yeah. are we? We're so great. Back to the mission at hand. You are on assignment today, a tough assignment Man, at that, Joe. Where Hunter are you? Station is amazing. Show us, show everything. Yeah, Hunter Station is Nashville's newest food hall. And to explain more about that is Laura Wilson, who has two businesses inside Hunter Station. How cool is all this? This is super cool. Um, a food hall uses the same kind of shared economy that right. you see it going on in a lot of WeWork spaces and stuff. So this is um, all kinds of small food businesses yeah. and restaurants. And they sh and we all share a front of the house. And so we have a grand opening tomorrow. And what a big deal this is. This is really cool for our city, especially for East Nashville. It's great for East Nashville. You know, several of the businesses here have owners that are from East Nashville and live here. Um, Crystal and Joseph of the Grilled Cheesery have yes. lived here since 2010. My husband and I have lived here since 2002. So we've just, we're just we really excited about what's going on in the neighborhood, and we, we're excited to have this kind of food hall. So you can have a family come here, and everyone can go and get exactly what they want to eat. Perfect. Someone likes at least three things at Hunter Station. <laughs> right. Now, at 1130, a little bit later in the show, we're going to go back inside. We're going to have all the food laid out, correct? That's what I'm excited about. Yes. How do you think they got me over here, Laura Smart, <laughs> by laying out a whole table full of food here at Hunter Station? Grand opening tomorrow. We'll go inside and check it out. A food hall. I had no idea what a food hall was, but it's fantastic. We'll show you more, guys, coming up in just a little bit from East Nashville. Joe, it's actually one of my favorite places to go. Carol's and listen, twice. right up. Uh, right above your interview subject's head is a, a parking notification, but parking 90 minutes is free around back. So oh, that's listen, amazing. get your park on. Thank you, yes, Joe. It is. Go inside. So parking we'll is in easy in East Nashville, that's which like a, is not something you can say very often. No, and that's like a dream come true. She's right. All the different places, take your family, everybody's going to find something they like. I know.